They're calling it India's 9-11, a coordinated attack by Islamic militants against multiple targets. It started about 9 p.m. near the gateway of India waterfront and spread across Mumbai's business district. Freed hostages were herded to safety, clearly terrified. Some were badly wounded. Others climbed from windows using ropes made from curtains, clinging to drain pipes, telling of narrow escapes. I told everyone to put their hands up and said, where are you from? Yeah, are there any British or Americans here? Australian actress Brooke Satchwell hid in a bathroom cupboard at the Taj. We're just hoping everyone else who is inside is out as safely as possible and that it, it's over very soon. Brett Taylor was a loving husband and devoted father. He was shot by terrorists and died on the way to hospital. 71-year-old grandfather Doug Markell was also killed in the gunfire. The former deputy mayor of Wallara in Sydney's east was holidaying with his wife Alison. The Thai government has declared a state of emergency in the areas surrounding Bangkok's main airports. About 8,000 protesters took control on Tuesday night. 3,000 passengers were trapped inside, including many Australians. They haven't told us anything you now, like we don't know whether to leave or stay. People were taking advantage of the situation. They were sleeping on baggage carousels at the check-in counter. Swimmer Nick Darcy has formally pleaded guilty to assaulting fellow competitor Simon Cowley. In day one of this matter, I believed that I was innocent because I was acting in self-defence. However, the New South Wales legal system is a little more complex than that. That complexity forced Darcy to plead guilty to recklessly causing grievous bodily harm. Nick Darcy then, fearing another strike, uh, punched Mr Cowley once. And that punch broke Cowley's jaw, nose and fractured his eye socket. Darcy faces up to 10 years jail. He'll be sentenced in February. An American toddler is lucky to be alive after a set of keys became lodged in his brain. And I said to Stacy, uh, honey, you might want to check on him. I, you know, I think he hit the recliner. And, uh, of course, when she went in, she realized that he had fallen on the key. Honey, oh, you might want to go and check on him. You might want to go and check on him. Yeah. Call <laughs> Dad's, eh? We're all over it, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, exactly right. Yeah, honey, I'm on the couch. Just no. go and check on the kid. It's the last quarter. Yeah, wait till <laughs> Sunrise returns tomorrow from 6am.